Oh, wow. I see two pieces of fenton. This cobalt stuff is gorgeous. O-M-G. Boys and girls, again. It's happened again. <laughs> Good morning, boys and girls. This is Jason Thrift Trader coming back to you with another video. Today's video, we continue going through mystery boxes from the QBC Hoarder Storage Unit. This storage unit has been giving and giving and giving, and this video is gonna be no different. We run across tons of Fenton glass and tons of vintage new old stock Barbies that she tucked away in these boxes stuffed them in her storage unit and just totally forgot about them. Enjoy the video, guys. Make sure to hit subscribe, click the bell so that you get notified when we post new videos. We're gonna get right into it right now. All right, this box says blankets, pillows, Fenton. This is what we're after, Fenton glass. Fenton glass. Yep, Fenton glass, no doubt. And I already see some. <laughs> oh, wow, I see two pieces of Fenton. This cobalt stuff is gorgeous. No, nah, don't worry about it. It's not in the way? Okay. Yeah. That is pretty. Is it hand painted? Hand painted by S. Smith. So thank you, S. Smith. For you the made beautiful it. artwork. Yeah, very beautiful. Gorgeous stuff. Okay, there's another we got here. That's another hand painted piece of Fenton. Right there. Yep. Look at that. Nice vase. Even got the Gorg hang tag still on it. Gorgeous. Look at this. This ain't Fenton, but this is handmade. Wow. Oh, this is probably a tablecloth. It's circular. Yeah. That is crazy. This that stuff that is, is old. Yeah, it's old and made. This stuff has a lot of worth, guys. All right. What do we got here? It's a head vase. Oh, we darn it sure is. Yeah, these, these things go for 50, 60 bucks. Pretty easy. Do they really? Very easy on eBay, actually. Um, this is what they call... It's... It's... Well, they call it a head vase. Usually, you know, a lot of them will just be the head. Um, but this is about the same. This will go really easy. This is a baby doll. This is an old creepy baby doll. Yeah, and she is uh, LGTI, 1990, China. Ooh. Oh, big blue eyes. Okay. I'm going to dig on your side, Jason. I'm going to gander your goodies. Gander my goodies. <laughs> that's Fenton. This is cool. That's Fenton. Wow, that's really pretty. Very pretty. You'll get a good look at it right there. What's stuffed in it here? Wow, that's really pretty. Let's show the bottom. There it is. Fenton, hand painted by W. Nix. So thank you, W. Nix. Yep, thank you very much. It's a Fenton basket. Nice pillow. Baskets are Fenton. There it is, fifty-seven fifty when it was uh, purchased. Probably worth that or more now. This is a blanket, a blanket. Blanky. Nice. What do we got here? Oh, this is bedding. This is all bedding here. All bedding. What do we got here? That is. Uh, okay. Is it a tablecloth? No, it's just fabric. Just fabric. Yep. Oh, okay. Pretty stuff though. Okay. If you like purple glittery leopards. Some people do. Yep. Oh, here we go. More of this goodie. If this stuff's old, we're talking about some good money here. Really? Yeah. You can easily get 40, 50 piece, uh, dollars a piece for that, that wow. kind of stuff. That's pretty that's easily. Pretty cool. It looks like some pillowcases here. Yep. Some of this stuff, <gasps> I'll tell you, if it's like vintage Ralph Lauren, you're talking about big money too. This is made by... Uh, Martex. So, don't know. We'll have to do some research. Made in USA, though. That's a good sign. These are more pillowcases. There's another blanket down there. Another blanket. That's, another blanket. That's, that's the box. Let me see. What's going on here? Crafted with pride in the USA and in America by Mary H. Thank you, Mary. I'm digging the glass pieces we found <laughs> in this box. Oh, yeah. That's it. That's that box. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, <laughs> another box labeled Collector Barbies. Another box. Another box. And you found some good ones in the last yeah, one. The last video, guys, we found hundreds of dollars of Barbies, and maybe, just maybe, we'll do the same again today. <laughs> so without further ado, let's just break into it see what we've got. 
first and foremost, we got this beautiful, beautiful <laughs> uh, heart-shaped butt pillow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, butt pillow. Okay. I see a lady that's lost her head. That's a shame. So, I don't know if she's worth anything. Probably not much anymore. Barbies. Oh, my gosh. Look, 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 yep, look, look, look. There you go. Here's another Hollywood Legends collection. Scarlett O'Hara again. Come on, baby. I don't think it's ever been opened until now. There she is. Gorgeous. Absolutely incredible. Okay, so there's another Scarlett O'Hara. Ooh. Some... Uh, this might be, this is German. I'm going to have to do some research on her. Yeah, it's got the floppy eyes. <laughs> floppy, <laughs> the eyes. floppy eyes. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know what we've got there, but look at here. There Tina Turner. Is. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> kidding. <laughs> no, this is uh, Marilyn Monroe. Yep. Barbie as Marilyn. Oh. The seven year itch. This could be some money. Collector edition. This was 1997. Oh, MG, boys and girls, again, it's happened again. <laughs> Here you go, Jason. Oh, 1990, special edition Barbie. Happy holidays. I was six and you were five. <laughs> that's true. Dude, that's incredible. Looks like, this is... looks like brand new. Like, yeah, it's never been taken out of the box, that's for sure. Uh, there you go. This Evergreen Princess Barbie, limited edition, the Winter Princess Collection. Oh, yeah. There she is. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. That's interesting packaging, isn't it? Yeah, it's... Compared to the other ones. Yeah, that's different. Pull one out, Justin. Okay, here we go. Yuletide Romance Barbie, third in the series, Hallmark Special Edition. There she is. She looks very romantic. Yeah. Razzle Dazzle Barbie. Oh, no. Barbie is Marilyn again. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is incredible Marilyn Monroe gentlemen prefer blondes here's a happy holidays Barbie special edition uh, what year is this one this one's gonna be newer I think 1997 beautiful Wow here we go with another one it looks like a holiday one yep special edition happy holidays what year is this one this one is 1996 Awesome. Holiday Memories Barbie. This is another Hallmark Special Edition. Amazing. Forty-five bucks is what she paid for it. The stickers in the bag. Ooh, Barbie and the stickers. Receipt. Stickers. Barbie Hallmark Barbie stickers. Yuletide Romance. Another. Yeah, that's a special edition. Oh, special edition. Happy Holidays Barbie. Gorgeous. I call that one a big hair Barbie. Big hair Barbie. <laughs> this one's 1995, guys. 1995. Walt Disney Cinderella <clears throat> Holiday Princess Special Edition first in a series. I think this one's probably gonna be worth some money. And this one was, say it from, was first in a series? Yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, Mattel 1996. Amazing. Wow. Well, here we go. And another one. This is uh I think the last thing in the box, close to it. Uh special edition Barbie. This one is just like the other one. Yes. This one was from 1995. And then there's something completely random in the box. God bless you. God bless you. God has definitely yes. blessed me. Yes, he has. He has definitely blessed nice me. Nice of him to leave that what. in there. A lot of people ask me how I do this. I'll tell you what. The good Lord is the one that provides for my family. He's given me two hands, two feet, and he's the one <clears throat> that gives me these opportunities, and I just run with it. Absolutely. That's the I truth. I agree with you. All right, so I did look all of these up on eBay, and what we've got, these are sub-$50 ones, okay? They're less than $50 a piece. I don't really want to mess on eBay with anything that's less than $50. It's just my preference, okay? But we've got roughly about $250 worth of Barbies right here. And then this as a set... They actually made three of them, but I have two of the three. I can sell these together for 70 bucks, 70 to $75 for these two together. This one right here is roughly about $50. Um, what's strange is there are a few of these that have the gold back like mine that have sold for $500 plus. But I think it's a fluke. 
I don't think that it's actually worth that much. Kind of like Beanie Babies, right? So <laughs> some Beanie Babies tend to sell for outrageous amount of money, but the same ones, you know, $20, $25. So this right here is worth roughly about 50 bucks. And this one right here is the winner of all of these, and she is worth about $75 to $80.